subscribe my channel like and comment and hit the bell icon for further updates and for more informative video thanks now let's dive in today i'll tell you yet another important feature of zoom that is share screen so if you click on this right side you can see here a tab advanced sharing option so click on it now first option shows us that who can share the screen at the same time so you can see here one participant or multiple participants so by default it's one so keep it one then we have who can share the screen if you want the participant the students to share their screen you can click here otherwise by default i recommend you to keep it to only host only first option later on you can allow the students if you want to see their screen also for any reason so if you click on all participant then you have two more options like only host or all participants mean that who can start sharing when someone else is sharing for example if a student is sharing a screen and immediately you want to show your screen so if you keep it to only host then you your screen will be cast to out across all devices but if you keep this all participant then you will not be able to cast the screen immediately you have to wait so now we will click on share screen when we click on share screen we have these uh, basic few tabs first option is share screen so when you click on this your screen is shared across all devices across all the student participants so i don't recommend to share your screen because when you share your screen when you will minimize your window you want to do something on the desktop a student will be able to see all these things so to refrain a student from viewing your desktop and all these things what you can do you can use the alternate option for example i have opened the powerpoint presentation before starting the zoom meeting or maybe during the zoom meeting you can open the powerpoint presentation before sharing your screen so if i click here now this is the layout now student can only see this layout when you minimize it for example i'm minimizing it now you can see my desktop but a student cannot see the desktop only the powerpoint presentation will be open in front of them so that is really a handy good option that whatever uh, application you want to show them just open it on hand whether it's a youtube video or anything now one more important thing that when you are showing them the powerpoint presentation they can write on it yes they can annotate on it so it might be annoying for you so how to disable them for annotating on your screen okay first you see this is the screen of a student now another thing that if a student click on their screen there is a pencil like mark when they click here then they can write anything here you can see here this these red lines and they can do scribbling and this thing will be reflected to your desktop also your main window also so how to refrain them for doing this you can see here pencil mark they can choose highlighter arrow anything they want to draw they can do it so it will be really annoying for you if you are showing them the presentation so to refrain them from this we will first go to the extreme top position and then you can see here more just click on more then we have here option disable participant annotation so if you click here they will be disabled now i'll show you their screen now you can see here if even they click or tap there is no pencil mark here so it's mean they cannot annotate on your screen now so now uh, how to remove all this scribbling you will click on annotate and then you will click on clear all drawing so in this way you will get away and now you can easily uh, show them the presentation when you cross this and then you can continue with your presentation now if you want to switch to another app for example you want to show them uh, the zoom video if you want to stop just click here stop share but now if you want to uh, show them the youtube video then you will click on new share again then again you can locate the tab like for example here i have opened my zoom the video which i want to show them so i'll double click it and now this window is open in front of them and now i can maximize it and i can start the video now one more important thing when uh, sharing a screen i will stop sharing 
when you click on share screen and if you want to show them the video now you have uh, two option here share computer sound and optimize screen for sharing video clips so these are the two very important option if you are showing them the video if you click here it will optimize the sound and the video if you do not click here there will be a lot of lag actually it uh, change the frame rate of the video so it is very smooth whether the connection is slow or fast however the internet connection is according to the connection it optimize it so i recommend whenever you are showing them the video must check these two options and for example if you don't want to share your sound you want to show them the video and speak side by side so what you can do you can uncheck it so the computer sound will not be shared but for example right now i want to share my sound so i will click here i can continue youtube video now there is one more option if you go to advanced tab now we have these three tabs point portion of screen music and content from second camera so you can use any for example if you have secondary camera you can use this option also now portion of screen this is very important for example if you want to show them a certain portion of your screen then you can also do it just double click here now you can see these green borders so this is the only display area which student can see you can extend it now a student will only be able to see this portion this portion which is inside this green boundary they will not be able to see the right side of your video the downside or any other thing the header of your uh, web browser anything they cannot see they can only see this thing and when you start the video subscribe my channel like and comment and hit the bell icon for further updates and for more informative video so only this portion they can see so this is really cool uh, feature if you want them for example on your screen uh, there is a certain portion where the question is written where there any uh, solution is there if you are browsing through the internet and you want them to see only the certain portion where they can uh, get the idea of answering any question so you can share it so it's really good only share the certain part see you and please subscribe my channel